Xenolog Museum Melee. Lady Rasulina, we're here. This is the Interrealm Museum I was telling you about. There are weapons and tools from all kinds of realms on display here. I see, it's beautiful, but ah, uh, could you remind me why we came here again? I heard a rumor that there was going to be an interesting event going on today. I thought you might like to attend. An interesting event that's awfully vague. It is, but I have it on good authority that said event is indeed quite popular. Ah, uh, what do we have here? Visitors from another world? You're just in time. You mean for the event, and you are? I am this museum's curator. Pardon the intrusion. Just thought I'd let you know that the event is about to start any second now. You should get yourself down to the exhibit before we get things rolling. Wonderful, it would seem we arrived just in time. Er, before we go, what exactly is this event? Oh, is it a raffle? I love raffles. It's a battle to the death. A what? I got you, just kidding, we don't shed blood here, but there is a kind of competition and a martial one at that. You see, this museum collects weapons from all other worlds. Warriors from every corner of the Alt Realms come here to fight for them. Most of our items are rare and valuable, so they draw quite the crowd. Oh wow, I would very much like to see these, they sound quite impressive. Indeed, indeed, so while you're here, you may as well participate. I just need you to sign this waiver, which frees us from liability if, uh... Well, you know, one of you croaks, by accident, I mean. Croaks? Gotcha again, I'm just joking, but the contest does get heated. M not many contestants are still conscious by the end of the day, and don't even get me started on our maintenance bills. Oh, really? But of course, a tough group like you ain't got nothing to worry about. Well, uh, let's hope so. Thank you for the words of warning. Don't mention it, now off with you and try to enjoy yourselves. Well then, Lady Rasulina, shall we be off? The exhibit is getting quite noisy. Yes, let's go. Interesting. Hmm, there really are a great number of contestants out here. It truly is as popular as they say. Yeah, it's packed. It almost reminds me of a festival, except instead of fried dough, they're serving violence. Hmm, and it appears there are a large number of treasure chests. I wonder what secrets they contain. Not to mention that it looks like some contestants already have rare weapons. So those are fair game too, huh? And we just beat them up and take them? Hmm, I've never mugged anyone before. It seems sort of mean. Maybe we should reconsider. Oh, no, milady. No act is too mean to inflict upon an enemy combatant. We must remorselessly go forth and fall upon them like lions upon a flock. I, for one, intend to pry as many items from their unconscious bodies as I can. I suggest you do the same. Jacob, hang on, Jacob! Jacob is freaking ruthless. But with that being said, let's actually go ahead and begin. I don't see why not. I don't see why not. Here we go. Defeat the boss or let her escape. Now the question is, who is the boss? It is you. Now there are treasure chests as far as I'm concerned. So the real thing here is to get Kaze there. Because I believe we, we have Lock Touch. And basically what Lock Touch does... Forgive me, I have no grudge against you, but I cannot allow you to win. If you wish to surrender, give me your weapon now. No? Very well. If you don't know what Lock Touch does, I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys already do know, but... It basically allows you to open doors and chests without actually having the key. Which is good. It's good and it would make my life a lot easier. I think Aqua can take a hit from you. Uh, so I might as well just sing to Kaze. Actually, there's no point. Um, luckily, I have Ana as well. Because she also has lock touch. So bring your ninjas, bring Ana, anybody that just so happens to have lock touch, check your skills. And not every single one of your allies needs to have it. Because you know, there's not that many treasure chests here. I see. To the victor, the spoils, eh? Then I will be victorious. Come, fool. Bring me your, bring me my booty. Okay. 
I wish I could say that to Camila, but I chose a girl. Um, a girl avatar. But either way, I mean, Camila could still get it, though. I'll tell you what. If she's down, fine, fine, I'll help. But only if I get to play with the weapons when we win. Or, er, I mean, train. Train, not play. Oh, shoot. I hope no one heard that. Yeah, wait. Do a critical hit on Ren Heaven so the noise is louder. There it goes. Now they definitely didn't hear it. That was 150 damage. Takumi is, like, way stronger than he looks. I'll tell you what. Just wait until we get Ryuma in there, then things are going to be a little difficult for people. I, I don't see why why don't I just kill you. A fascinating competition, but only I have the ability to, we to wield this Siegfried. And I will not see it taken and used as a glorified whisker shaver. Can they take two? Oh. No, they can't take two. That was my question. I was like, I wonder if they could take two. Of course they can't. It's freaking Xander. What the hell are we talking about? Um, why not? Oh, yet another fool who thinks I can't fight back. Hmm. I'll disabuse you of that belief if you don't disarm. You won't, good. Oh, wow. Yeah, wipe that book off. Wipe that book off. Okay. Now... I say book. I meant to say tome. Now let's do let's do this. Why not get Ryuma to move? So anybody that attacks him, well, I mean for one, you're a joke if you attack him. I mean, what the hell do you think this is? I'd rather get rid of an archer. Do I want to get rid of an archer? Eh, doesn't really matter at this point. I will not go easy on you. Do you hear me? I'm going to take all of you down. Just don't take my Raijin toe from me. I don't think they're going to be able to. They're going to go attempt to grab it and you're going to kill them. It's just what you do. That's just what Ryuma does. You don't really have an option. It's either, you know, you let him kill you or you attempt to fight back when he does kill you. Now, I can't come here because there's too many archers down there. So, I'll just I'll stand right here. I can break this. Might as well. I don't see why not. I mean, oh, N no attempts to attack. Well, I guess this is gonna be very short lived. But I wanted to get. I'll, I'll at least example what happens if you get a chest. I guess I can't really do that, can I? How far can can Camila go? I can't tell because it's in the way. Okay. How about we get... Hmm. Because I want to ha show you guys what happens if you get a chest. I guess I don't have to necessarily end it this time. Uh, I need to get Ana here. Might as well just kill you while I'm at it. That's one. Oh, wow. Aegis. That's not going to be enough to save you, though. It was a good try though, which I guess is like all that matters. You tried. Yeah, he, you failed, but you tried. Critical hit on the soul? Nope. Not even necessary though. Not bad at all. How about... I mean, I guess I can kind of just... Let's like get in the area where I can just kill. So I can kind of chase the person that we're supposed to kill. I just want to go ahead and get, you know, a couple of treasure chests. Just to go ahead and show you guys what's really popping in there, though. Can you leave? Are you going to leave? I don't know if you're going to leave. You see, uh, Camila can go, but... Camila could have reached the chest. Mm -mm, those weapons look divine. I think I'll take one for myself. Oh... But why stop at one when I can take them all from you? Oh, wow. I like that attitude. The greedy attitude by Camila. One, two, three. And I don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do next turn. And then from here, it honestly doesn't matter what I do at this point. 
I'm sorry, but I need your weapons to bring peace to my realm. Or wait, should we be using real weapons for this? Ah, too late. You poor soul. Fell into peace. Of course you did it. Question is, are you a threat though? Are you actually a threat? Of course you're not. I should have done a close range so they didn't have a chance to attack uh, for future reference. Um, I'm going to attack you because you're annoying. And you're practically useless. Survive of the strongest, eh? It's so simple. I love it. Oh, don't you dare surrender. I want to enjoy this. Not bad. And plus, if that didn't kill you, then Takumi definitely would have. Uh, something definitely would have happened. Okay. Let's do Rasulina. Just to build some support. And then I'll come like this. And you can't even take one hit. Especially not now. Oh, especially not now. Yeah, you did. You sure did. Uh, Xander... I'm gonna take you guys all out. And oh, it's you. I don't know if you guys recall. Hi, I bet this place has all kinds of unique treasures. What what are you doing? What are you bothering me for? I don't have anything you'd want. She was in I believe Kaze's daughter. Kaze's daughter's paralogue. Spoiler alert. Oh wow, she was actually here. That's interesting, it really is. I believe if you play your cards right, you can actually capture her. And last I checked, she can marry Corin. She can marry your avatar. And you're not going to be able to take two. I have three more coming if you live that other one, so. Oh? So you took the snake spirit. Not too worried about that. The hell was that? You just punched the wall and... Oh, here we go. Okay. Now, let's get Anna's lock touch to come in handy here. And boom, just like that, we got a tiger spirit. And then if we get Kaze to come here and get the chest, we have fortify. So basically, open the chests. You took something from the chest, I can go get it from you. Uh, well, I can't necessarily get it now because the distance is real, but might as well attack you. Get you out of the way. The reason I got Camila out of there, obviously, because there was a bunch of archers. I believe Kaze can take them all on. So I'm not too worried about it. Now, the question is... Why am I killing all of you? Do you really deserve this? Yeah, you deserve that one, though. 60 damage. And a Master Seal, so I'll take that. We're getting some cool stuff. We really are. If we play our cards right, we'll get even cooler stuff. Now, I want to take I want to take you out just so I can move. And actually end, some, end that person's life that took the Snake Spirit away from me. Because it was supposed to be mine. Yeah, it really isn't my fault. Now, just get Ryuma there. And you're going to be dead for sure. You poor soul. A critical hit on the Ren Heaven? Nope. Sorry. Now then, Kaze is actually kind of screwed. Uh, this is going to be tough for you to take. And there you go. I don't need your forgiveness. And now... Oh, every, it's just like they're all perfectly lined up. 
Xander can hit from a distance. Nyx can hit from a distance. And then the one that just so happens to be standing in front of Keaton. It was actually kind of crazy. Okay, so we got a mend. And this is going to be your life right here. 150 damage right here. There it goes. Hmm. Why do I feel so safe ending the turn right now? Oh, this is bold. Okay, good. I got scared for a second. That would have done 22 damage. You have a 9% chance to hit. I dare you. I dare you to hit that 9%. I was about to say that would have been some bull crap. Wait. You were from a child paralog as well. I mean, you're not that important, but... Yeah, your battle has ended for the second time now. I don't need a bull naginata. Not today. That's why I felt safe having Kaze there because archers hit Kaze. Yeah, you can hit Kaze, but I can hit you back. Retaliation, buddy. And the last one. I hope you land this hit. I really do. There's nothing I could do about it. Kaze does what he wants. And he's actually the man, though. Got you right where I want you. Here we go again. You're gonna miss. That's what I thought. Okay, so here's what I'm thinking. Uh, why don't I... Okay, I'm just gonna do this. And then I'm gonna get Azura to sing to Rasulina. And we got an iron bow, get a zero to sing. I guess I don't have to sing, I could just do this as well and just be like, yo. But you're not dead though, so it's not worth it. I'd rather just sing. And then I'll be able to get the other chest with Anna. I think Anna can go that far. Last I checked. I'm gonna kill you from this way just to give Anna perfect leeway. And you're dead. Let's check what this in this chest if we can go that far. We can. And a spy's Yumi. Not bad. Now to end this. Okay, let's just get a quick rundown as to who has what. I kill you, I get an iron sword. I kill... I kill you, I get a snake spirit. What about your friend? Your friend doesn't have anything. Um, kill you, I get a seed of trust. You give me a steel shuriken. Steel Yumi. Okay, here we go. Might as well take your seed of trust. Why not? And Seat of Trust, I will send that to the convoy. And now, why don't I just end you? You have 54 health. I'm probably going to get a critical hit, so I doubt you'll live. And there it goes. <laughs> you poor soul. Poor soul. Thanks for the weapons. I appreciate it. Finally, it's over. Thank goodness. And we've even acquired a great many weapons. Yes, I think we can call this one a victory. I imagine these weapons will prove very useful in the days to come. Oh, looks like you youngins reaped quite a lot of harvest today. Oh, Mr. Curator. Yes, we did very well. Thank you for telling us about the contest. No problem, kiddo. Glad to see y'all enjoyed yourselves. There's one thing I think is important for you to hear, though. Now we have some time. Y'all know that 
gear we keep here and the chest and whatnot, all that was donated. Donated? Yep, donated by people whose realms no longer know war, you understand? People who have found everlasting peace, the most precious of blessings. I see, so there's hope for our world after all. Yes, the contestants you fought, though they came from war-torn realms. Every warrior you saw today was here to obtain weapons for their homeland. I was glad to meet you, strangers. You're a lively bunch, but it also made me very sad, because every new face I see here represents 10,000 others in pain. I see, so all those people, they were just like us. They weren't fighting for prizes, they were fighting for their families, their homes. I am sorry, milady, I had no idea that was the event, that's why the event was so popular. No, thank you, Jacob, I'm glad we came here today. You're glad? Um, Mr. Curator? Thank you for everything. Today was, today was, despite everything, fun and very helpful. We'll come again and again and again until we find peace. And then we'll come back once more to donate the weapons we've gathered so that others can use them to achieve the same peace. Hmm, yes, I think that is an admirable goal, child. Haha. <laughs> You might even have kindled some hope in these old bones. Now, if you don't mind, I'll mosey on off. Take care of yourselves, whippersnappers. Alright, let's head back, Jacob. We have a peace to make. Yes, milady.